Happy Easter! I'm gonna read this one. <clears throat> and this one's based on the prayer, so I'm gonna say the prayer. God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, the courage to change the things I can, and the wisdom to know the difference. You receive without pay, give without pay. Matthew 10, 8. Two friends were talking about honesty after a meeting. The program that night was about being straight and straightforward with each other. All at once, one of them said, Mary, there are times when you seem distant and cold, and you make it hard for me to get close to you because you don't respond, <clears throat> and you make others uncomfortable too. Mary glanced at her friend and shouted, Why can't you let somebody be who she is? Mary's friend was working very hard on honesty and straight talk. Unfortunately, she wasn't working equally hard on acceptance. The conversation between Mary and her friend illustrates perfectly what's involved in the serenity prayer, change and acceptance. Mary wanted acceptance. Her friend obviously wanted change, especially in Mary. The serenity prayer links change with courage. It took courage to confront Mary honestly and to risk the anger of her response. It took courage for Mary to respond. But the prayer also links acceptance with serenity. Neither Mary nor her friend seemed very serene. Both were too involved in change, either achieving it or resisting it. Perhaps if we all were to, perhaps if we all were to work harder on accepting ourselves and others, we would reduce the pain that comes from trying so hard to change others. Isn't there wisdom in that? Oh, blessed Lord, help me to keep change and acceptance and balance and to keep me and keep me from trying to change others. Amen. That's a good one. I hope you're having a blessed Easter. I am still working on my taxes, so I have to go. <laughs> and I don't know if I'm gonna do a poem of the day. I probably will. Um, I didn't get to that yesterday, but um, we'll see. Love you all. Bye.